Thank you, my brother. Your Royal Highness. Nime Neneme. Name. Nana. You are welcome. Your Excellency, our former president, and the national executives, the regional executives, and the constituency executives. You are all welcome to the Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs. Your Excellency, with your kind permission, we want to commence today's program. Ni Vice, we want to commence today's program. Okay, we'll call on our Lady Madam Priscilla Osafo Mensa to pray for us. Let us pray. We are grateful to God Almighty for the gift of life and the gathering this morning. It is our fervent prayer that God will visit us and sit through with us, even as we interact with our former president. I have prayed in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Madam Priscilla. We will call on our chief priest of Usu traditional area, Numo Belenfo, and the other priests who are present here to assist us with our traditional prayers. Thank you. Wo obaye inpai alo wa mapitalim ka ha his excellency the incoming president John Romani Mahama na 2024 election so kuni yem na epe no John Romani Mahama the president in waiting nani clear me me na me o je
kale nun wo to nyen no ko nyen nyen ke yawo se won fa won nyen wo ke nyen ke wa nyen file ko pa da nyen shi a ka ngen tutun tun a file logo e logo e logo e jo son e ba ni nawo manager mama e ke ba sumo a ka ni e ba tale ke ka fu ina mi ni elemi nsajin ewo e ba sumo ni e ba ye a fi e jo e ko ko ni ke ko ma bi anu wo wa ka ko no ko yi mo fi amun ba wo ba le awa wa tu se ba jo ni fe mo ko yu e mo ke bo no ba ke wo ko ke wo ju gba wo wo ba yin so ju gba no ke wo ju gba wo wo yin o se e wo wo hele mo fi amun ba ba wa wa tu ni me na me che me ke yen me si che me yen me yin ba fo yen ko chu ku yen trash yen ka bre ku ma ba ku ma wo a ka o e se bi e ko o yi jo ma me ba e ka e bi yen de njo mo ebi yen de njo mo yen jo ale osu e jo mo le e osu e jo mo le ni o wa si ajo ni mra ku e ni bre ku aba kan le na ko le aboyo aboyo asike nte ba jo le e bo nche yen se ni won nche yen ma won nche yen se bra won nche yen kan yo yen ku aka unu nsha wolo alo nyu won yi wolo yen pe yen ba na ko mi ami ni yen ba na mo ni yesu mo ni e kele ba ya e ba ni no ko be bi ene wole le ni enyo wo pa amoko wo wo ka je a ji anye meji wo ko ba wo ya fufo bi e ke bi o ba bu si ni ni pe wo ko ji o yu e mo papa no ba gbara se n papa no wo nu won mo ndo gbara se e wo na wo ba wa la ke jo mo won ke se bi fe o si eh o si ki na ba fun ni wo npa e fai wo pa fai no kwa fe mo si wo npa fa ke no fe no fe o kwa njojo mo kwa ka ju moko moko won ka ye moko hin moko won ka nye moko ayin sha ke gana bi ko me ni gana wo be man ko nu wo yo don afke gana majini bole wo fe yo mo na me yo france wo nu france ke bi an e ba fo eje e ngbe wo ya wo je ma wo ji si a che me na mo wo ba si nyo wa ha wo ke nyen ya lo won si nyen wo won pa fo a ke nyen ke tu ijuro an ma mo fi a mo no ni anu kwale pe ajepo e nche kure bi abi me ne ba cho le ke ka fu ina mi ma ji a che ma bo ma ji a che ma bo ma ji a che ma bo ni e ba cho le ke gburu ina mi nyo nya ba ye ko nya nu a nya ke jo mo jo ajo na ni le nya kure bi a ma che nya si ke nche mu ko nche nya fe mi nche nya ke jo butu apra ka gbe ko yi ke ye ko e ko bo da ranchura ke ranchura ka gbe langba nya nta ko juro ke npa ni ngbra me na si me me na si ju ni ma ju na ma ju e fun fe ni ba je mi ke ba ta ni wo se yi ni e papa ba show mi cho no mo nya bra o ka o ni gbe fa iko cho de wa cho de wa e yo pa e dia nche Thank you our priest Numo Belenfo and all the priests that joined him to pray. We are so much grateful. Nevis with your kind permission we are continuing with the program. But uh, we will start with the reps that came from the various traditional areas. We have without when I when I mention your traditional area because of the numbers and the kind of feet that is in here we will not be able to mention your name so when you mention your traditional area then you wave at us thank you we have we have with us reps from la traditional area la traditional area thank you 
Nime, we have Shai, traditional area or the traditional council reps. Thank you, Nene. We have Osudoku. Osudoku. Thank you, Nene. We have reps from Teshi. Teshi. You are welcome, Ni Me. We have from Nungwa. You are welcome, Nime. Pong. Reps from Pong, traditional council. Thank you. We have Simpe. Reps from Simpe. Sempe, thank you. You are welcome. Then we have Osu. Thank you, Ni. Pram Pram. You are welcome, Neneme. We have Ningo. Rest right from Ningo, traditional area. Thank you, Nene Banahene. We have Tema. Rest right from Tema. Thank you. And rest right from Ga, traditional area. Ga, traditional area. Then we have Ada. Ada. Thank you, Neneme. I will leave the microphone for Mr. Desmond. Ajay, too. Nevis, with your kind permission, I would like to introduce our Queen Mothers and then members of this August House. We have from my. Okay. We forgot to mention reps from Nglishi, Alata, Jamestown, traditional area, if you are here. Okay. We have the acting president of the Ningo Traditional Council, Nene Tete Banahini the Third. Okay. Yes. Please, uh, we also have. Numo Belimfu the second. Numo Belimfu from Osu Traditional Area. The acting president of the Osu Traditional Council. Yes. We have Nana Amponsa Dokua the third. Osu Doku Paramount Queen Mother. We have Nana Tomale Kabuko Dagojo the first, Paramount Queen Mother of the Adan traditional area. And then we have Nana Dugbako Dugba the second, Paramount Queen Mother of the Ningo traditional area. And we have Na Usabu Abi the first, Paramount Queen Mother of Pram Pram traditional area. We also have Ni Otinto, Ni Otinto, the, the second Paramount Chief, traditional uh, Simpe traditional area, and then we have Nene Tete Waka, the third Paramount Chief for the traditional uh, Pram Pram traditional area, and President of the Pram Pram traditional council. And then on the days, we have Bachonlo Ni Ashite Akonfran, the third, Paramount Chief, Teshin Traditional Area, and then President of the Teshin Traditional Council. We have Nene Abraham Kabu Akuakun, the third, Paramount Chief for Adan Traditional Area and then President of the Adan Traditional Council. And then we have Ni Tete Utu, the second, Paramount Chief for the Poon Traditional Area and President of the Poon Traditional Council. We have our Vice President of this August House in the person of Obu Adenoche, King Professor Odaifu Welenchi the third, Paramount Chief for Nungwa Traditional Area and President of Nungwa Traditional Council and the Vice President for the Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Desmondajete. All other chiefs from various places, you are welcome. And we have with us also the Regent of Katamanso, our former 
Minister of the Greater Akka Region, Honorable Afuti Abu. He is also here with us. Thank you. Thank you very much, my brother. Let me also invite the regional secretary, who is a son from the Sudoku land, Honorable Teoflos Tetechai, to also do the introduction of the dignitaries who are following the incoming president 2025, John Dramani Mahama. Good morning, Johnny. Me, Vice President, Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs. Nime, Name, Ni Wanek Pishi, Yavine, Yashibami, Mimbanya do Mani, you Fiaka Libine, Kawe Bene, Wea Bene, Nuku Crede, His Excellency John Dramani Mahama, of Fenwaliake, your twenty twenty election, say Ekamambi Nasani Ba, Danny. Wa party a constitution a fake jipo. Wa nibi ni ma bi towo alo ame 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 solia keshi ma hiye lo nupa iba fake ha ame oke na kanibi a fe wo wo manifesto em. Afine eke beni e tele twenty twenty e iba yale na kano koni ma bi ke ame hu ame bi. I will manifest to me in me. Ni Vice President, His Excellency John Dramani Mahama, Meneka eye biye ne, eke nyen e bote gandangwe kukwa enano, neke nyen naku sandiba. Ejake, nyen 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 gandangwe, ni nofi ano kuwe, sani eke nyen ena sandiba. Lo dani eba bote ne ba eke kui kwe kulu me ba na sani ba sani eke nye eba na baka uke yue mo koni noni nye hunye yo nye hun nye kele ena na kasani ba lo lebi ne kwa ya biye be NDC Greater Accra Region ke NDC the National Executive Committee ke Greater Accra eni ne wo bna constituency executive say wo fe wo ye bna ni mas makeshi maji eh na nupo e kumeni yo wo ti ye bia ja ke chu emi hu edo eh kenkle wo hie wo members of parliament mas makeshi ame wave mi me ke na me eh wo hie um wa former minister for employment in yama shite ye biye eh constituency chairman for shai usudoku lehun ye biye ne wa jenche wa deputy chief whip ye parliament honorable comfort doyo kujo lehun ye biye ne mp adan constituency ke honorable sam nate george MP Ningo Pram Pram Lenho Ye Biene. When here wa former CEO Ni Lenho Greta Kra Fita Onukpaahi. Honorable Sivesa Mensa Ni E Hye N H I A. Mr. Kue. Ofani owo in a few ni onukpa nabu. When here wa former ambassador for Italy. Honorable Mole Eni Lenho Ye Bie. Wa hiye wa enche wa national vice chairman Professor Joshua Alabi ni eye former FA former regional chairman Honda former regional minister Honda ye wa te ye biye ne wa caucus ni ji parliamentary caucus se Greater Accra wa nano domolo ni ji honorable ni lante vandapoy la hon e ya wate ya diya empi ododo diyo diyo ya ne ya retirement akbe ne wa hiye wa konsuensi niji shai osudo ku konsuensi nye jenche nye bi honrabo linda akwele okulu la hon e ya diya ne wa hiye wa former chief of staff 
ni ameke his excellency john dramani mahama chuni deputy former deputy dr valary soya lehun eye bi ene o nye wo um, papa niji nana philip acha paramount chief keha asin driving traditional area agbene wo former chief of staff niji honorable julius debra lehun eye wote ye biye is royal majesty fiake mechwane unupai ni ameyo twin ni amekenye ba chuni shade ne twa no manyaba all right thank you so much honorable to follow start chai so your majesty we've now got into a place where you have to give us your opening remarks with your kind permission agago ago ya o mi ka ta me twa o mo nya ba wo fe wo gbin afi eko mi twa o mo nya ba eh dani maha the welcome address in the sara ke shi minta ma fe remark ko dan ma pa ni me ke nene me ke wo wulo me ke afai be an edge greater cry original house of chiefs your language no use or be an agada me that i know me agbele for on kafo she nya kafo so je ya ke she do nya ba ye man se ye mo ke mo no ba ye gan ye mo to ba ye dan me ye mo wo ya mo ko be ene enyo interpreter we ba chon she she ke han ale no me ni nu e e ke fo jugba e ja ko observation di me pe ene ke abape ene ke ame ka me ye mo ko se ka ashe an e ja ke man se ye mo je mo fa mo nu e yo ye ma te ni me ni ame ni ame ye ye ma te ame mo ame ye je mo titri ni e yan na ke ba tun ni o ba pa fai ka gbe kan ke fun shi en mo fa mo afi free ko no yue je mo no ni o ba nyo yue ni wo ka ya wo shi Your Excellency, Former President John Dramani Mahama, Professor Nana Jane Opoku Ajeban, Mr. Julius Debra, Former Chief of Staff, Honorable Johnson Asiedu Inketia, National Chairman, Honorable Fifi Kwete, General Secretary, Regional Executives, Name, Name, Our Noble Queen Mothers, representatives from our traditional councils members of parliament members of the press invited guests ladies and gentlemen on behalf of the president and members of this house and the staff of the house and the good people of greater accra region i welcome you all to the greater accra regional house of chiefs your excellency on this occasion of your visit to the to our house we wish to officially congratulate you on your successful re-election as the flag bearer of the National Democratic Congress NDC NDC party for the upcoming 2024 general elections and wish to extend same to your running mate Professor Nana Jane Opoku Ajema. We have observed the political scene of Ghana for at least 32 years. Over the years, experience and records have taught us that democracy is a game of compromise where consensus building is paramount. However, some party members engage in useless arguments to the extent of insulting or physically attacking their opponents in the name of politics. We are all witnesses to these excesses over the years, and in most cases, they start from the media platforms which inflamed passions on some of the media stations with affiliation to their political parties. 
Our appeal, therefore, is that media platform should not be used for political propaganda and its associated viciousness. We further entreat presenters on radio and TV platforms and the production team to gather hardcore facts before interrogating political aspirants. Check and double check your facts. Ask relevant questions and also know when to pull the brakes when tempers flare up in discussions. Stick to issues and excuse needless sensationalism. All that matters is know your aspirants, make a choice. Know your aspirant to the best of our understanding is more figurative than literal. To us, it doesn't only mean that as elected, you should have a family of friendly ties with the political hopefuls who are standing for election. We urge everyone to as assess the worth of those persons, their intellectual abilities, what they have achieved before, and for that matter, what you should expect from them and the political party they represent, and based on which you then cast your vote. As chiefs and fathers of the land, we support all our children in this election competition. Therefore, any chief tying and aligning his gaggles around a particular political party is doing a disservice to the very people he is supposed to rule. I urge our chiefs to desist from partisan politics and save your integrity. We all know this year is an election year, come December 7, we shall all be going to the polls to cast our votes. Can we have politics without insults and unwarranted blames? Yes, we can. We expect our political leaders to learn from our court system. In a criminal trial, for example, the respective lawyers for the complainant and defendants, no matter how bad its submission is, they don't brow in court. All they do is to lay down their submissions for hearing. The one who makes a good case wins. Different ideologies should not bring violence leading to conflict. The lawyers call themselves my learned friend, not my enemy. Opposition is always the complainant, and government is always the defendant. Our, politi our politicians should learn from our lawyers. Politics is not war, rather an exchange of ideas. We therefore wish the politicians to also address themselves as my political friend, not government and opposition. My political friend. Your Excellency. Former President of our Republic, John Dramani Mahama, members of the Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs are calling on you to witness these current happenings. One, Greater Accra Region is the capital city of Ghana. Two, Greater Accra Region is the gateway to Ghana. Three, Greater Accra Region is the seat of government. Four, Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs represents the whole Greater Accra Region. Five, Greater Accra Region is not just a cosmopolitan, it's a region having its indigenous called Gadangris. Six, most of our lands has been acquired by government for various purposes. The following are situated on our lands. The castle, the Jubilee House, the Parliament House, Ghana Post and Harbour Authority, Meridian Post Services, various courts up to Supreme, all headquarters of our security services, military, police, etc. Various ministries, Bank of Ghana, Kotoka International Airport, the only international airport in Ghana, and many more. In return, what have we got in? Nothing. His Excellency, think about this. The members of this house and the good people of the entire region will be much appreciated if whatever you think befits the capital will be put in your manifesto. Submit it to the regional house for our comments before election. If indeed 
This regional house represents the whole Greater Accra region with all its components. His Excellency, John Dramani Mahama, just take a look around and see it yourself. Government comes, makes money out of the region, government goes without doing anything for the region. This dynamics must change before it is too late. Thank you all for coming and we wish you good luck on your endeavors. Uchodo Wahan, the president of the regional, vice president of the regional house of chief, professor, professor, thank you so much. Oh, Chode Kuhn, Chode Kuhn, Chode Kuhn. Nwo, your excellency, about present, I'm a speech at Kehambu. So, Mr. Adu, when your presentation, Emma, through the regional chairman to the president. So, oh, no offer, ne? Can we allow Baha or Papa, the regional chairman, Baha, receive on behalf of His Excellency, Queen, the document? Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, Honourable Samuel. Thank you, thank you. Chode wa eko, chode wa eko. Then the Vice President, Nana me, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, any was a Biane Obache, the Greater Accra Regional Chairman, Honorable Honorable Emmanuel Ni Ashimo, Kuni Ewabasan, if you thank you. I go Nimeke Name. Ni meke name mimba nye du umanyi Mimba nye du umanyi Mimba nye du umanyi uku Mba shia Nwo Madja tui mbe Ndu mogeta ka rijin Na Ni Woke wonini Ifo wonini mi Ke faipa mo Ake Nise ochi ni huwe Nishukwe sa woba bie Si nisesele nsi John Dramani Mahama E afini bi kume ye man se Nwa kwe yengma ya ale ni ibaba Nwa ke ulo Babie kum wakpa faa ke shi Kengmene Nungwa adu wo Ni jiecheli wo Nwa wana hunwe Le waba Ni meke nama hiye Nwa ke fai Pamo Ni iba mwene Iwi mpi E ya ke Unupa kake Ke unupa juwe tape Ke doga fene ya wu ebushi Wo ni chumo peni sama feja ke Ni bi ni akeba ta agbo Alo akwa shi agbo e Lo mwene mimba Kuma shi agbo Eja ke waba shi ya Kusun bo Lo wako webi e kusun fene sana feye Owa fe Eke Eche pepe pepe Ni meke na me inton Alu na kano ya le ni rado ni mwajo ni ni nyeche ni twenty twenty five fe wewe wana ni owa fe wia ya ni woya eja wana ke meni swala ite ha wo ameko ke twenty twenty five fe la ite wo spo biyong ufanye maji yeshi ba mi dani machu kusume maji wo parliamentary candidate ni wofe ushiki wofe ushiki ha me. Ye wapopano na mbanyi wa hii kibaya mla wapwe hii wakamifemba bie idake walake bie nile kakupa fin ye bie gama nyeme ke gama nchume fin ye bie nji dane nye jiopu una yeshibami wapalimenti kanditi ya kue eko una eko uchele ke kwe yoki keche abu Duo baje nchi ya honorable Agnes na mumbu lati leji moni dumoshiki ya kwa kuhusuensi doctor ni kwa ya honorable Ibrahim Yusuf Jaja ayawaso North kwa wote honorable Francis Susu Madina honorable Asai Odamiti. Tema is, bekuni huwe 
leji wo mayor yetema eke wati honorable afred oku vandapoy abloma south honorable rita odoli suwa dade kutupung honorable teresa awuni na tolo ba na okakwe north Honorable Zenato Rollins, Clole Clote, Ekawati Ashaman, Honorable Enes Nogbe, Ekawati Ayawasu East, Oye Honorable Nasa, Turi Mahama, Yes, I am here. I will enter in a case. Jenny, the fact is, yes, I am here. I am a baby. Yes, I care. Not too much for me. I'm not poor. Yes, I am here. I'm here. I want me. No, I'm a dumosi. No, 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 no Eke wote adam honorable comfort do you kujo kansa noji deputy minority chief whip honorable dan latif abluk masendra adentan atola adentan honorable muhammad ramadan Ningo Pram Pram Samuel Nati George Lejuku Honorable Ben Ayeku Na Pung Katamanso Honorable Joseph Tete A popular Nina Chole Joti Ododu Diu Diu Fred Ni Kote Ashi Leji Moni Bachaki Wo Nye Minu Nabu Ni Lante Vanda Poe Ni Ke Iba Ashi Kuni Mu Kwa Bachano Ni Chumo Pupa Ni Chumo Tema West Wo Ye Lawyer James Enu Felis Odati Trubu Dr. Kofi Hem Ayawasu Anyasu Trum Emmanuel Aloti Sege Honorable Daniel Bise Okakwe South Honorable Enes Adumakun Ufane Shibamie Ifangbefiyo Eke wote Okakwe Senta Honorable Baba Sadi Domi Abra Ubum Isaac Awuku Yembo Domi Kwa Abinya Eli Plen Akrugu But you are not actually a man from Felix Akwete. I am also Central Raf Saman Selom Afenyo. My West Reverend Kweku Ado. I look my North Irabra. Ayawa so West Wogon Dumelo Ni me ye shiba miye Be me nuwa ke ya atane Wo nye me nuwa ke ya atane Wo la ke shinye na ame ne Ke ame bana mba shakbwe Nye ba ni Tema Sentra Honabu Ebi Bright Shai Usuduku Nye nche nye no mi Honabu Linda 
au clou. Ni me waba ke wen ni nyuma. Si waba ni wa papa e ba big be. No ba ni waba wo hie wo kase bridge. Katon abagbo e ne wo ke ti na digwe ni aka wo katon abu abu mi no di normal wa ne ni. Enyo wo hie wo bi lo hu e wo te bru e jenche na me flo wo mi hawo no wo ko ba lo wo hie lo hu e ba dan wo hie dan ni sikli e mi ni di sikli nu lo wo hie katon e ko me e ko me nyo man enyo onu pa bo aba ke se fi ai nu otu mu ko e ko tele le taku e Upale sabla, leka chie fushi. Nuo, woke nu. Nuo lake nuo bane huwe. Agwe laite. Mina vini. Wo manche meke manye me. Na sahi. Ni ahu fafa. Inwi yuku wake. Nye huu don kena nyuasmu. Keje woke ya. Nuo nu hu. Nuo hiye. O yen katon katon lo hon, yon ma yon, e yon. Ni ni bie fè, ni wo che hon yon. Wo wo le tako. Wo tako e le, wo dmo gbe hi. Wo a che tako. Si tako kanon, ni wo ke fi ta hi. Ni wo, mene wo ba. Ni wo ke ne ke ni bi ne ba ha. Ni ne, ko te wo bi vla mi yon. No la chole, jom mo wo lo e. Yu cho, nung ma ke ine. Ite no ke, ke fe ekbe ke. Ni ya manche ma hiye. Ni ke ya fonsi. Na wole nga ito. Mene, o papa iba manche ma hiye. Ni ke iba fonsi. Ni iba ni iba hi unga wo. O chami. Ko o yeje. Ma to ne ke ni bine ahabu. Ni o ke ha ni me. Sena atra se, mi papa me son, no ni ta se en che, te si ke nungwa, lo ata si e, lo o chavi. Ene, Greater Akra Region, National Head of Office, ke the office of the incoming president, he says, he says, John Dramani Mama, he can si agbo, nye twa, no mani aba. Oi wadon, the Greater Akra Regional Chairman, Honorable Emmanuel Ni Ashimo, ni me, nye wadon, oi, nye wadon, he ni wadon, he ni wadon, the chairman of the party, the national chairman, the Papa Ne, a MP down, if a minister who down, a general secretary, can our party in the NDC, a Biane, the G party, a national chairman. She got a chair by maybe Lille, she got a general mosquito, the only general in Ghana politics. Honorable Johnson, I said, do you get a try to go in a way? Your Royal Majesty, the Vice President of the Greater Accra Regional House of Chiefs, Your Royal Majesty's Paramount Chiefs, Paramount Queen Mothers and other chiefs, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, Your Excellency President Juma. Well, I would have loved to also speak. Then I remember that today is Monday. I don't speak uh, on Mondays. So, <laughs> so next time uh, when we meet on a different day, try and speak Ga. Uh. But let me begin by offering our sincerest apologies to the chiefs and queen mothers on behalf of our delegation for subjecting you to this 
excruciating heat. It is true we didn't create the heat. We have no hand in whether the lights should be on or should be off. But the fact that the gathering is occasioned by us, I think we can participate, we can share in the blame of keeping you under this heat. So we apologize profusely for that. We hope that better times will come when, when you meet, you meet in comfort in your own conference room. Your Majesties, I don't want to extend the pain of keeping us in this heat, and so I'll make my comments very brief. There is one thing that is dear to my heart, which I want to bring to the attention of this House of Chiefs and through you to all the chiefs in this country. I had the privilege of participating in crafting the 1992 Constitution. And we were very, very careful in dealing, in balancing the interests of chieftaincy and democratic structures. We know that we started running our affairs under our chiefs until colonialism came. Now the colonialism too could not change us enough and they left us with their own government, governance structures, that is democracy. So we are fully aware that we are not fully under democratic structures and yet, we are not fully under our traditional structures. So any arrangement that should govern this country must aim at balancing the forces within these structures. So in 1992 Constitution, we deliberately made an effort to remove the authority of central government made up of politicians in deciding who should be a chief somewhere and decided that the institution of chieftaincy is hereby guaranteed and then we abolished the authority of central government in according recognition or removing recognition and then we limited the sovereignty of the Parliament of Ghana in making laws in one very significant respect. And that is where the laws affect our chieftaincy institutions. They cannot be made until we hear from the chiefs. Some people have tried to narrow the interpretation of this clause to restrict it to installation of chiefs, removal of chiefs, and chieftaincy litigation. I think that is not the only intention of the framers of the Constitution. We recognize that our identity is determined by our culture, our customs, and our traditional practices as Ghanaians. And so the Constitution vests the authority of protecting or the responsibility of protecting our customs, our usages, and our traditions that define us as Ghanaians in the hands of our chiefs. So if the Constitution says that wherever a law is being contemplated or is being made, and it affects chieftaincy, we need to consult the chiefs or we need to hear the opinion of chiefs 
I want to believe that when there is a law being made that will affect our customs, our practices, positively or negatively, we must hear our chiefs loud and clear. Recently, there is debate in this country about whether we should accept LGBT or not to accept LGBT. But the silence of our traditional authorities is too loud. We must hear you, Nananom. What is your view? You are the custodians of our traditions and our usages. stages. And where you interpret something about our customs, it assumes finality. So this business of some Ghanaian saying president should not as to some law that affects our customs and traditions, and others are saying the president should assent to it. That tango can be broken only by the custodians of our traditions and our usages. And I'm pleading. We can't order Nananum, but we are itching for your direction. We want to see or hear or get the direction of the custodians of our, of our culture and traditions in this country about which way we should go, about which way the president should go, whether he should assent or not to assent. The legal systems are there. I'm not worried about what is in court or what is not in court. Because by my interpretation of the Constitution, where a proposed law affects our chieftaincy, and I want to adopt a wider interpretation of chieftaincy to include the responsibilities of keeping our customs the custodians, our traditions, and our usages that define us as a people called Ghanaians. We want to hear you without taking much of your time and subjecting you to more excruciating heat. I want to rest my case here and I want to thank you very much because we, whatever we do, we cannot succeed in NDC unless we get the support of Greater Accra. We thank you for the support we have enjoyed so far, and we hope we can count on the support of the chiefs, queen mothers, and people of this dear region. Thank you, and may God bless our homeland. Guide. Ochoade Waha, the national chairman of the NDC. Honorable Johnson, as Secretary General, must do. Chwade Kung, show the Vice President, Ke Wananame Ke Omancheme, in the worship of the if you are Ke Obahani Mancheme, Name Yonuku Wimu Fiu, Ari Yonuku Kwamanyame, Eka Akbena, the incoming President, Dienche, His Excellency John Dramani Mahama, by respond to the uh, concerns of our chiefs and queen mothers. So, Mr. Adu, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Simon. On our program, our His Excellency is supposed to give us a remark. But because of timing and the heat, we will take questions and uh, suggestions, opinions from six of our chiefs. Six. And please, it should be brief very brief you know the heat that is within the room so that uh, he will address all the concerns whilst he's giving his uh, speech so we have new cabra boni from usu uh, thank you uh, oh, thank you mr president madam all the existing protocols i told me nikoni usu at manche your excellency ufani one qualify my Chinese or Greater Accra, what you fa? Chune, I'm a God is my time. Me, Eda, come on, she come on, she come on, go, come on, she fe. 
ni make ma jubo fun fi o i encroach for spawn no a po fai ke ni ma fe bo pa no ba ta se no po fai no ha fo bi e fe ya le awon now have a modern osancha conference center ni at least e ba ni lo ma ti ba fe 501000 call the chair of your president one po fai ke je ko ti be ta me na ma bi a fe gogo do e na sa mo one po fai one thousand conference hall eh na gbe no won e ma po fai eh uh, select me ni bad mo se greater accra gan dan gbe won ko nyifai won ko te school ye greater accra ta fa che won ti ni bi ami si ke fi gan me adun mo si e ka boy so ta che in quotes e pe wo ma chamana san ka parliament every gan dan mo si ti e gan do e ta je ke yo gan ja kon ko si ke fi ta fa che e ka lo won ye me ka ta je won je ni bi ami president of army ka ke mi won je ni bi ami she will work by the fire. Can you select candidates? Eh, money money. Eh, need a lot of that money. Okay. We are proud of that. Let. Work by the fire. If we have fine, it will most be next for you. Can you work by the fire? Can you select candidates? Eh, money is there. Jam. Can you budget go by what? What time is it? Eh, can you talk to me? Eh, eh, it's what it's what it's what time can you talk about the fire? Work by the fire. You can work. You can talk me. We fear money. But we get a crack. Can you be? If you can, you earn it. Ta fra che ke inte mo ko ma mi ya mo ja fo nda won pa le fa ene e ba wona dugba cha no ma ni awa ni o yi wa don eh dani wa ba cha na lo ko ma cha no wo national chairman e pio ka wa president rick inge program pa ko ne imaya lo le e ma bi block ko ne e an represent wa che na legion lo ni vice president with your permission our national chairman will leave us and the world fan eke ebabasha oi wa don thank you so enok will continue yo inche me ka enye me ya fa enye ka mi o manye mi ho me ha nyo manye ho if you are my yellow Niji neighborhood. Won't qualify, If you are Yeah, one E ha wa ye pi wandalesi wandalesi wa wona gba ko me ni gba wo ye ana wa ji ka wo man cheme pa ba o ji wo man cheme ka nu ba fe le dro mo ni ba e je gbe che ni kwa wo man cheme ka wo man yeme o ju pa enyo no ka nu bo fe le dro mo ni ba ta si en e bi ake ka wele le ke gbe me le fe mi ocha me tu mi krata ha me no ke tu mi krata ni jo ke he wale wo lo ne e ka asiwo asu esi afo wo ye ada e ko be no ba ya yo ko ni esi oni ngbeye wo be le ba ni soldier fo nyu alo police nyu mia eta ikedu mo sipe alo ehin etu ko no ke ya se e kura na gba ko ngbe na e wo ka ngba fe le dro mo ni ba e bo mo de won qualify koni ha wo heko ni akuchi akuchi alo maji maji ni mo fi amon agba ni gbe na ni e ka ya je me ko na mo mi ya le e ja ke eh mp se wo acha me parliament e wo na de ka se de gbe fa moko ojo gba koni ka no ko ngba moko na e ka ya je me ka mo mi ha le kunu yele ba fe wo fe wo no e ja ka fi ya na fi abe ko wo nye yi wa don We will take two from this side, then we come back. Uh, it's Royal. It's Royal Highness King. Member of the His Excellency, former presidents, President. Member Odemaje. Um, there is one beautiful thing about politicians that I would like to. My name is Ni Kwade Okupum. 
la traditional area ayo yo aken we ga she no ni ma we ma we go for a few ke ke ga cha no koni there's one beautiful thing about politicians ni e for na agba but we pass money amechaki wo former president if it is very clear he has ganye sake he has learned his lessons what about his followers have they also learned their lessons you only see them when they are in opposition that is where they share their concerns love and care but the moment they get to the top there they, they seem to be forgotten about us so much money mark parfait i can make fair in here what former president say okay yeah okay bang me name i'm a cassie no cooked a day in your mommy can you hear mommy can you know to fair on a case in lele in a experience the cassie in kj experience a me no many in your face a fair i'm a fair nakam bona fee new was a a tree tree in a near about you here why you're not bad boo yeah 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 my name is nj kadang be well not bad you Politicians are men and they may Come in your position. Come in now. No, I'm a tower. Call to me. Poor me. Who no? With the exception of Nlayo. Ne beni in your office. Call to the lady. She and Igbeke Bahiri Boke. Sylvester Mensa. Ke na odule le huye bomode ojuba. The rest of them may walk panye fa kama na you move from the top. Call to me. I'm a who. I'm a call to ano. Ni ni ne who no. Ba wake dole ba yue ni kwa wue ya wobi atuimi. Some of us we are kimeke. Kwa wako ba yue ba yue. Kwa wako ya wya. No sani to mo boni wo manye yue ya kesi. Former president afamo menko men ni apart from MPC ni representer wo ni ame ya rounds kuni wo grievances se ni ame tap kuna akahale bona fini nuchu mo afijuba chalo banya ba. Eh, mochum, nita, kwa pe, ati mu nyobo, pia kaya hiya na adui ya pe gani, kaka wada ngi huwa dewe kwa kaya ne wapi yewe, se akega, kedangi. Ya Excellency, mochum, kama na ligwino, ubawa neno, ne ukewo, manisem, kaka election ne mahi. Hene ini minyu mo tu minyu kaje kene manye kaje lejo na maka chano ngai ikuwa pene na adua kwenye nyu nene kone di e enu nene wanyi minyu mo di e kope kafu ya minyu pia gana nuna kwa ya parliament onu wange majority ke minority ebe clear kibwa ni dem ebe clear na maaji brone maaji kwa papa. Kana mama je kwa yego kupeka hundred kwa one seventy eighty kwa hundred and something alo e kupo ninety kwa one twenty lejo se ebe clear because some of the MPs chuo ya nini hii ma kwa pe e kope joke hamu because nini wanga nunge sisi yako kwa yewe nini e magba onya ne kwa yewe nini kabene banga makomano na fonske tembleso it will happen in greater Accra. But since 1992, Greater Accra, especially the Dangbe land, were disappointed with me. Keep one of them. We are now a percentage of 60 and 40. No, we are now more than 70, 30. If you don't take it light, we are not going to be able to be very careful. We are not going to be able 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 to no ko election esu tapi ja seat of fun obena no abi e na clear kekanene no no enyo wa ma ho tum ka oje wa mami je ke e badasin e dasin yi especially manya na ni wa ke mo tum ka o chake wo odwem no ke yoba ne lo hi wa matuni wa matuni wa matuni that's the cause of the Kumanya Kenyan. He has a call soon, you may, Madu. Oh, so ling, go oh, yeah, what a shy or sudoku. So, always when they come and they get to the door, that is the end. 
They think Sai Osudoku is Dodowa. But it's, up, eh? it's two different traditional areas with two paramount chiefs, with two paramount queen mothers. Osudoku is far different from Sai. We are far end. And when we talk about the deprived area in Greater Accra, it's Osudoku. But when we talk of those who have learned, it's Osudoku. The greatest banana farm in Greater in Ghana or West Africa is in Osudoku land. The Lantin farm uh, factory is in Osudoku land. President Iqbal, but with due respect from here, get some people to tour Osudoku and give you a report. No one tied road in Osudoku. No one. One tied road in Osudoku. From Akusa to, you know that the place very well. From Akusa, Akusa to Osuwe. From Astrajansi to Osuwe. When you are coming from Tokpo, when you are coming from uh, Agotwa, Tokpoli, you can enter Osudoku through these four routes. But none of them is tied. Um, I live in Insawam. When I'm coming to Osudoku, I have to pass through Edukrom. No command your swim. I could see a little more pure junk while people. Well, Papa, or Sully, I mean, I'm a son. No, Sully want to change. I won't say it anyway, I'm saying it here. Or Sudoku, or Sully want to change their mind. But I'm afraid because I know you are coming. And it will be sad that when you come, then there will be change. We don't want it. So please get your men to go down and check for us. Then, the last one is our secondary schools and our hospitals. Ikenga Munyu Tuka Osuno, not any other traditional area. Get some people to toy Osudoku and give you a report. Thank you very much. Please, very brief. Next question, very brief. Thank you. Many uh, advice. I tell me, you could bought a question. I'm in a match. I'm in a do do on in a shy traditional council. Uh, cabin advice now will block a what to one man. Be on okay. Name a good name and then a man name make a name make a name in total project in here my care here in being on the down a jacket be peer care or touching it are yes and over where the forehead of everybody whether they like it or not you see it from their eyes and then the forehead uh well man yeah maybe you should come on yeah it can work oh i can let you should go pay you more she it's on my case yeah what i was also the cool no, Malcolm and Grumbo, a German education, a year greater class, and I say you should do. Sanima, you lawyer, don't you care about me and about me? More family or your personal issue, you buy you a call came up here, if you look at me, pay a care, your car me. No, you all care when your back car will be over back here. If a mamma go by and body law will know me, they will say it. So it's come from the region. A careful job. No, Moko Akafe, no, Kuni, Akela, Kishi is trying to be a little bit selfish. Right, no, Kayu do do I yemo, yemo greater cry yemo. Oh, you are now go back in a cry. Thank you, Ni President. Ni Vice Mochu, Kekle Kle, no Ninga Lane, Makai, His Excellency, Jika, Wanga regional boundaries, the Wanga traditional boundaries. Why, and then you know. Greater Accra, wa regional boundaries on a set or as a traditional boundaries, you know. Titiri ji wa ke Eastern Region. Epi onka muni tulo kodo ke wa zuba anenga hiyo no anga misa is being encroach. Ne P ga alo dangeli nanga zuba anga anga wade se wa nini mo hiyo leome ne wa kame wo huzuma. Anga was a bad trap and all. Why, I never been you one and me here blow your peco come on your whim. Lot was a bad me full currently or my deck of virgin lands is not registered. The pure no go here lands commission, your excellency, a pure car obey me is serving a regional lands commission or no as a chairman for research. Loyal in any day, 
Uh, heka ke nge gama neke wa madeke corruption uh, e, e ba hiye nge le jon wa we Islam's Commission e jake o nga zuba bena oko o yosi o midnight no ko ke touch light ke GPS ya mano e sove zuba e nge agent nge Islam's Commission e ke ya ha ke ka plot bena mo project ko ba anon o zuba ke ya ha ke aka pe project o na ape se cho Chapeo biya nenge no. E mapo nyakwe ka biya nenge no koya paga kwa nrange la ube na. Keke mache wane ke zukwa ha. Nyakwe e ada singe kotu ke double seas of lands. Wa makpape. Ke ma o yebwa ne biblo nyahon no ba. Wa ma suwo ka greater kwa zukwa ame o. A hiye ne wa protect me. Se encroachment o enge hiye chon. E nyo ne. Watu hii kabene na nadeo, ngao wadangwe kupano, wapewe NDC hemsiblé, semu kaji kwa wabapawa, wabisi kwa dangwe li, lo gadangwe li enye me ne ana ministerial positions. Ehe waha wasamia, kwa wamana gadangwe li ne amaba ministerial position, especially cabinet, ikai kwa beno bakuo. Wakpe, ne wape list. Jamabio mioni ashite was a regional minister. Wakpe nga wem, wape list of gadang me bi ne wale kaka ha me blonya na manye maye no. Ne wake wake mba anu wake maba hon. Bene wake wakbe onya, ade wake his excellency, ebe wem, wape pa etro wako tukun ka basi mweno. Wange si bi yi yokun, ka jana leke ma ye buwano ba ane. Ke wake noko ma wama no e blolo mochun. Ni president. Ke luma yin ke onokwa efene babiye. Mimba yedo manye. Yifa ane yengba yeji ni anfotik beche. Ni jie pa. Aso fochu na manche. Min somo ye nungwa manche jishi. Ake divisional chief. Mimi kwa faa ni mawe yu nefiu, idu yu moni aloni ni yaloni eba ganka dangu ya fena kujukwa ndenge. Ada safi, ada sani afu leke ba shipo ne no, ni bi ete alo nyokume akayosia bu ake bioje, alo neken bienoje. Nuzi ope kwe yu moni uyo, ni kwa bagan kadangu ya miye, una ke wau yu mo. Niji ga kadangbe ya awi kwa ya wasku ya me alacho ni eji wa mancha chame wanaaba agbo ake ubi ba ya wasku baby ni eba ba shia eve eka pimtui yalo ashante tui chabele wasku ya huye kadangbe shibano nuo taka awi gana be kukuwa baby kofia wasmo ina akpa chowa akpa fai. Wali yake His Excellency, wali utena, wali nchu, wali kano ubai kuhune, ubai chuo uha wangu na kano, kuni wakwaja mahawo, ni ga, kadangbe fen, afi ga, alo dangbe, akasi lo ya school ya ame hawo, ifanye, yumo ifa, shini juu ti, yumo ni mto mawe, mene ni yuo adong. Sio. If you have a member, man, you watch it. The vice president. I told me, you know, I go and only judge. You know, more yes, 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 no go. If you have a new member, you must money in case we are president. He came in here. If you have a one who attracts the people, if you have a one who gathers the people, no one can fight. Can you have a drama? No, the battles are not going on. A boy modern, they check the work by how. Kuni kwa babi ana gadangwe bi yao bi kwa afi le gadangwe region ba ngo wona kuni ndo anya eho mofe wome ya kwa ute yuko me kwa cha mbe no pe na kama ano ana meni yoje no kwa ehi cha kimo na ba afi wa region kwa gadangwe region kwa ba ngo wona kwa ana le kwa baba yao bi efi kwa wanumu yako me yu ya kwa kwa tiki kwa yako me ano meni dumu shi yeye ye ndi stiki teno ya fi wakbo eni jie game jiame ni bepe eno yi wa wawi shi waba pa wakame ufen ya fai boni afe ni wakewohi awo nuchi momi 
kaja ke wo ke wo wo nu chumo mi joba ya de ka pupa ya no ka be ise nu ke wa de mo shin aba fun chika fi mi ni aha wo chika ja ke wo me wo ha gbo ni yo ne ka pupa ya no ni ama de mo shin le kan fan ha ke ke be ise aba fun chika fi mi ni aha me nu ke ne ka be ise wo ga me ana wo nu ni fata e ni fi o eten ja ke wo bo modern ko nu wo du su mo chu wo wo te an ake ga me nu wo su mo wo hiwa ke wo su mo wo hiwa ke mo shin ne ke gba ye na fe ko nyi mi ganyo ko ya ne ta wa mo po ne ehin ye wa mo o ba nyo ke fe mi ni o ke wa le ne ya ake ganyo jile ne fa na nya yura don o chore wa ha wo man cheme ke wo man yeme eni wo se bia ne wo de nche wo nyeme nu wo bi ki wo sun lo e ya assembly man da papa ne nyimo e jo le wa de nche e si je me e ba ye mp ne ye mp e hu e e ba fe deputy minister fe minister e ba fe vice president ne e ba ye president ne nyimo ke ta si no kwano ko ne ma no be ko bi e se e be ko ko fe wo support in Russia. If you more make a bar, you can move here. Chorea is Excellency the incoming President 2025. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, Your Majesty and our king uh, acting president of the house of chiefs and all our traditional leaders who are assembled here i want to thank you very much for the warm welcome you have given us since we arrived here we're happy to be here in shao sudoku and uh, especially in dodoa which is a very historic town and when we were growing up, um, the elders used to tell us that we are too young and so we don't know what is happening in Dodoa Forest. And we kept wondering, what is this forest in Dodoa that we children don't know what is happening there? Now that I've grown, I also know what's happening in Dodoa Forest. And I also tell my children they don't know. But we're happy to be here and um, we're happy that um, you've received us warmly. Um, unfortunately, um, the lights are off. We've entered the era of doom so again, even though the government doesn't want to admit it. Every day they are shedding load uh, between 280 megawatts and 480 to 500 megawatts. But they don't want to give a timetable so that people will say doom so has come. Governments must be honest with their people. I mean, clearly everybody can tell that Dumso uh, has come back to haunt us. Um, we have decided and uh, we conferred with our chairman, our president of the house, uh, when we, we came initially and met them in the office. And we said that we would, between today and tomorrow, we would donate a generator to the House of Chiefs so that in this era of doom so if we come and they put off the lights again at least your generator will be working and will not be feeling as hot as we are feeling currently I'm also proud to be in Shai Osudoku where we built one of the best hospitals in the whole country on my birthday I came and celebrated with the personnel there and the hospital is still looking beautiful. It has been well maintained. The personnel have a very high morale. And um, we want to thank the people of Shai Sudoku for maintaining your hospital very well. I want to thank our Queen Mothers for the support they have expressed and your Majesty yourself for the support you've expressed in my naming of Professor Nana Jinopoku Ajimai as my running mate. I believe that women are our partners and if we empower women, we empower ourselves. 
Somebody said, if you educate a woman, you educate a family, if you educate a man, you educate an individual. The time has come for women to, to serve in the highest offices of government. And I'm sure that history will be made on 7th January 2025, when the first woman vice president of the Republic of Ghana will be sworn in. I want to indicate that Greater Accra region is the capital region. And as a result of that, it is hosting a whole host of people from all over the country. And that is creating several hazards for the local people, the indigenous people of Greater Accra. In relation not only to lands, in relation to dilution even of the indigenous culture in this region. And I think that you make a very good point when you raise the issue that government should help to make sure that everybody realizes that this is the indigenous culture of the Gandangbe people. And so I have it as a point here, and I'm happy you raised it, that we would increase the training of Gandangbe teachers and their posting to schools in the greater Accra uh, region. And so that's something that I have taken note of already. Um, Your Royal Majesty talked about elections and uh, peace in elections, and we are assuring you that NDC is a peaceful party and that we will play by the rules and we are sure that if everything is transparent, free and fair, we are capable of winning the elections and so we are not going to do anything that will disturb the elections. But we expect you as custodians of the land and respected traditional leaders to also be observers and make sure that if somebody is doing the wrong thing, you are able to speak up and correct them before they disturb the peace. It is the lack of justice that disturbs the peace. We want peace but there must be justice. If you say you want peace and you notice that somebody is rigging the election, you're not going to sit down and watch the person rigging it. You will react. And so let there be peace, but let there also be justice. The Electoral Commission must be completely neutral. And they must be impartial between all the parties. And they must do their work according to the mandates that they have been given. The security agencies should be neutral. Soldiers are not supposed to be in polling stations, they are not supposed to be in the collation centers, and so they should stay out. They can only come there when they are called by the police because law and order has broken down beyond the capacity of the police to handle. And so we hope that all these rules will be followed so that we can have a peaceful election and um, make sure there's no violence. There are a few issues that I wanted to talk about that I have on my paper, but I'll talk about them and then I'll come to some of the issues that you raised. Uh, the first one is we want to give chiefs more say in the local governance of our country. And so for the district assemblies, we are suggesting that a certain percentage of the 10% should be given to the chiefs to nominate their representatives to sit on the district assembly so that they also can influence what is happening in the assembly. Then aside from that, Accra is a rapidly expanding um, uh, uh, cosmopolitan area, a huge metropolis, and so we need to improve the transportation service in Accra. And that's why when I was president, we introduced the Ayalolo bus service. Unfortunately, our successors have virtually abandoned it. And so I want to assure you that when we come, we're going to revamp the Ayalolo bus service so that it can service all parts of Accra and let people be able to ride the buses to wherever they want to go. Because we want to introduce a 24-hour economy, we must have an efficient transportation system so that people can go to work at any time of the day or the night. And we believe that the 24-hour economy policy will create more jobs for our young people who are here in the greater Accra region. We also want to expand water supply to Accra. Accra is growing very fast. Recently, the Ghana Water Company complained that they can't keep up with the supply of water because of the fast expansion of water. What you do is you plan ahead, and that's what we did. And that's why between Professor Mills' time and my time, we added 40 million gallons of water to Accra's water supply. In the last eight years, there's not been a single drop expansion in Accra's water supply. So why, don't, why do you expect that the water will be enough? This is a city that is growing. 
And so after we added 40 million uh, gallons, at least in eight years, you should have added another 20 million gallons. We have started planning ahead already that when we come into office, NDC comes into office, we're going to increase the water supply from uh, uh, to, uh, to Accra either by expanding the pond station or pulling more water from the southern Volta to the city of Accra so that we are able to supply more water. Mm -hmm. I've also announced already somewhere that the issue of Grand Lands is a very disturbing issue. It's a vexed issue and it raises a lot of emotions. And so for the last time, when NDC comes into office, we're going to set up a commission of inquiry on Grand Lands to make recommendations on what government should do in respect of Gadangbe lands. And at the same time, it will also investigate looted state lands. Because the chiefs and people of Gadangbe gave land to government for specific projects. If government is using those, uh, the, the land for those projects, there's no problem. So parliament is working is Gadangbe land. The Supreme Court is working in Gardangbe land. The airport is there. We all are using it. We are flying in and out. But where government is not going to use the land anymore for the purpose that it acquired the land, the rule is simple. It says give it back to the owners. And so we have to get a commission of inquiry in and investigate those who have taken those, those lands. Because you go and see lands that government is no, no longer using. Private people have bought them and are building all kinds of edifices on them at the expense of the tra traditional people. And so that is an issue we'll take into consideration. A commission of inquiry into Gadangwe lands, including the issue of looted state lands. Then we'll also look at the posting of Gadangwe teachers. I had it here already, and I've spoken about it. And then also, maintenance of Gadangwe culture. The president went to Independence Day and wrongly attributed Tetekwashi to the Equapim people. Even though his farm was there, Tetekwashi is a Gadangbe. And he went and got the cocoa from Fernando Po and he went and planted it there. But it's because Gadangbe culture is eroding. So our children don't even know that Tetekwashi was a Gadangbe. And so we have to make sure that we uh, celebrate the achievements of the Gadangbe people so that our children will know uh, uh, what the culture is. We have the Tetekwashi circle, but we all call, they all call it Tetekwashi, Tetekwashi. They don't even remember who Tetekwashi uh, was. The first person who brought Koko. He's not from Ikrapim, he's from uh, Greater Accra. And so that's also. We are looking to decongest Accra. And so when we come into office, we're going to undertake a feasibility study to move some of the government agencies and the ministries outside the city so that we can free up more space and reduce the traffic congestion in the system. So some of the ministries, some of the government departments, agencies, we will move them outside Accra, not too far. There will be a highway between that place and Accra. We can even put uh, train services between so that you can just board a train and go do your business and come back. And so that is something that we'll consider. With regards to the local issues, I have some of the roads here, and some of them were awarded on contract, but unfortunately because we left office, those roads have been abandoned. And the ones I have here is the Afienya Dodua Road. It's only now I've seen them uh, demolishing people's uh, uh, properties. Nine months to an election. What really are you going to do on that road? It means we are going to have to come and, and, and finish that road. And as, as far as I know, there is no loan. They have not collected any loan for that road. So it means it's Government of Ghana uh, a consolidated fund that is going to fund it. And so it will take the will that we have and the respect that we have for the people of Shia Uzidoku to continue and finish that uh, project. We have the Ayikuma Dorimu Road, uh, the Adenta, Adenta Dodua Road, that's the one I was talking about, the dual carriage. Uh, Osuwem, Queen Mother talked about Osuwem. Osuwem Agoto Road is, is here. Then we we'll also, when I went as president to Japan, I signed with the Japanese Prime Minister the MOU for the construction of the Volivo Bridge. Uh, since we left office, that bridge has taken so long, eight years. If we were in office, it, we probably would have finished building it by now. 
but whatever it is, whatever stage it is, we will continue to talk with the Japanese people. I have a, a special relationship with the Japanese people because I worked with them. And so we will follow it up and make sure the Volvo Bridge becomes a reality. We will also give attention to all other abandoned projects. After a lot of demonstrations and protests, the La General Hospital uh, project has started. But definitely this government will finish it. We will come and finish and commission it for the people of, of La. The other um, uh, roads, Rahama Town Inner Roads, Dodowa Inner Roads, Luom Junction, Akusumbo Road, extension of electricity to some communities without power, extension of portable drinking water to communities within their constituencies. So those are some of the issues I came prepared to talk about. But let me also talk about a few of the issues that you raised. And I think one of our traditional rulers uh, took the words out of my mouth that the constitution gives guidelines for eligibility of members of parliament. And apart from that, our political party constitutions also give guidelines for how uh, uh, members of parliament are elected. And so the first step to getting more Gadang base into parliament and standing in those constituencies is that they must file and they must cultivate the constituency so that when they file, they'll get voted for. And so I'll ask you to encourage more of our young people to get involved in political activity in their constituencies. And when the time comes, they should be bold to file their nominations so that we can vote for them and have them elected into uh, parliament. I've noted the suggestion you made about a meeting room. Um, this is a very beautiful uh, uh, building. The architecture is unique and uh, we know it's a very historic building and so we'll preserve it but I agree with you that if we get a bigger room because the house has expanded a bigger conference room will, will be uh, appropriate so we've noted that down and then we can convert this into a beautiful museum so that we can come and children can come and learn the history of Gadangri. Um Normally, the president is only one person, but the president appoints many people to help him. And so you have ministers, you have regional ministers, you have district chief executives, you have members of parliament, and they should be a conduit to bring your concerns to the president. Because the president alone cannot listen to everybody in this country. And so we'll admonish our ministers when we win as part of the orientation, we will admonish them that they should pay careful attention to their regional houses of chiefs and their traditional rulers, and that if there are any concerns they have, they should quickly arrange and either uh, ask for an audience with the president so that the president can listen to them and be able to sort out any problem that they have. And so we'll as much as possible uh, uh, keep a close relationship with the various houses of chiefs so that we can uh, solve any problems that will come. Um, the boundary issue is not only with Greater Accra. There are several regions where we are having skirmishes because other regions are encroaching into other regions. And so it's something that the uh, Ministry of Lands and Natural Resources will take up seriously so that we do the demarcation properly. Everybody knows where their land ends and where somebody else's uh, begins. Because this is a cause of violence. In many areas, we've seen people lose their lives because of the skirmishes between uh, traditional areas about whose land is which. And so that's something we'll look at. Um, with regards to appointments, I've taken, I've taken notes of it. Uh, you are all one people, so uh, <laughs> and girls and Dangwes are the same people, but we'll take notes, note, note of it so that uh, we spread. The Constitution says that we should um, take into consideration geographical spread when making appointments. So I think that the point you have made is legitimate. I don't know the procedure for changing names of regions. I haven't seen anything in the Constitution, and it's never been done before. But um, it's something that I've written down. We'll take note of it. it has, there has to be wide consultation whether it is what everybody wants. And if it's what we all desire, then I don't have any objection to it. But um, I do think that it is not about the name. It is about what we do 
make Gadangbe great, you know, clean uh, uh, environment, enough social services, enough transport services and everything to make anybody who comes into the region see that, yes, this is the capital region. I think that is the more important thing than just the uh, uh, change of name. And so that's the last point that I took note of. I want to thank His Royal Majesty very much and to um, thank you for um, bearing with us. We should have come a bit early, but um, we got delayed um, at another function. And we'll thank you, and uh, if you give us permission, we will run off to our next program. Thank you very much. God bless us all.